Good evening, welcome back. It is Thursday, June 8th, 2023. We have very few birthdays and only one card to show for it. And just a few events which we will wrap up here really, really quickly. Starting in 1985 at Mid-Ohio in the IROC race, Bobby Rahal wins his first and I believe only career IROC race in that series. Him and Mario Andretti had a bumping incident in the closing laps. Uh, Mario spun out. Ray Hall went on to win. Uh, the following year, 1986 at Pocono, Tim Richmond wins his first race for Hendrick Motorsports. And he would go on to win a total of seven races, I believe, that year. Because he had eight poles and seven victories. And just an astounding season. Third in points, only three points behind second place DW. And this race was marred by a savage crash at the end of the race. Buddy Arrington spun out and pulled perpendicular to the track in turn one. And he got a glancing blow from Jeff Bodine. Just, just scraped him. Morgan Shepard hit his car real hard. And Harry Gant basically drove through what was left. Shepard was knocked unconscious. Transported to a hospital. And, and he ended up fine. Arrington had a bunch of... of, of uh, Injuries. Gant had a bruised heart, a punctured lung, some other injuries. I think some broken ribs or cracked ribs. Shepard and Gant raced one week later at Michigan. Arrington hired uh, Rick Baldwin to drive his car. Rick had a crash in qualifying. Uh, subsequently, uh, it put him in a coma and eventually led to his death in 1997, I believe it was. So, very, very, very sad situation that came out of this one accident. And then uh, also 2002 on this date at Nashville in the Bush Series, Jack Sprague won his only career Bush Series race. So with the birthdays, like I said, this is going to go by pretty quickly. Um, I don't have a date, but Mr. Bob Levine, or I should say I don't have a year, Mr. Bob Levine, former owner of the 95 car, is celebrating a birthday today, as is former Truck Series regular, born on this day in 1970, Carlos Contreras. Born on the state in 1961, son of Hall of Famer Buddy Baker, Brian Baker. Brian ran a one-cup race in 1986. And then our only birthday that we have a card for, born on the state in 1990, former RCR developmental driver Joey Coulter. And I believe Joey is the one that uh, had an incident with Kyle Busch that led to the RC Hold My Watch incident. So, I, Joey's got a few cards, but this is the only one of his that I have. I may have some 2011s. Those would be rookies. Those are in my rookie box. Like I said, this is going to be a fast video today, so we're going to keep it under three minutes. Let you guys enjoy the rest of your Thursday. Make sure you come back tomorrow. Have a great night.